You should come over tonight, fairy boy. Uh, all right, she got a cell phone. Okay. But I'm at the bottom of the water temple. My dad and Mr. Ingo aren't home. <laughs> Open. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no way, bro. Wait, he even took the iron boots off, my man. <laughs> I would go anywhere for Malin too out there, you know. The way she wears that Bowser little thing on her on her chest. Oh boy. I will still always argue that Malin is best girl. I don't care. Anyway, what's cracking, guys? This is it. This is the final Zelda meme video. We did it, boys. We finally made it. It's the final one. Don't mind. All the other final ones, those those ones don't count. And if you guys like these final Zelda meme videos, make sure, why did I make that plural? Uh, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. <laughs> Definitely for sure for the final one. Let's just get straight into it, I guess. No shot. An actual hover bike board going around in the public. That is the coolest way. That is just the coolest way to get around. Like, I'm jelly, <laughs> not gonna lie. It's an electric scooter, but it's the coolest electric scooter you ever see. Hey, yo, we're gonna make our own little battle golem out here, baby. <laughs> Let's go. It's got cannons. I even see Hudson on top of there. And we're going against another big rock. All right, seems to be doing okay here. I mean, it's not really damaging it, though. Well, <laughs> <laughs> well, darn. I do like that it was made from like the ruins of uh, uh, the bridge on, on Hyrule Castle out there. A lot of care and love was put into this to put all those parts together to make that work. <laughs> I am impressed. Now, if it only actually was as good as a battle talus. Oh. I mean, you're getting hit, but... Ooh, you missed one there, but he's in the water. Doesn't matter. He's dead anyway. As more get into the cage. Good shot out here. Keep going here. Next one up, baby. Good arm out here. Good arm. You only missed one so far, Mr. Moblin. And the Bokoblins are inside. And it's a dunk tank. Of course it is. <laughs> I mean, hey, man. The Bokoblin did a great job of chucking him in the goal. Oh, you did lose a little bit of hearts for that one there, but I think it was worth it. So Katsuka literally just made this an unreal engine fan-made zelda film ocarina of time and ghibli combined this is just the trailer november 21st is when this is gonna come out looks phenomenal i am so hyped not only because it has malin but also <laughs> because it's like one of those nostalgic fan projects that people just make because they love the series that much so you know it's going to be something phenomenal a lot of love put into it and that's what i like the most i'm looking forward to that one these are the skibbity toy no no they actually made toilets <laughs> and they actually function and he's shooting them <laughs> oh my god I don't know anything about the skibbity toilets. I just know it's just a head in a toilet. And that's as far as my knowledge extends on that subject, but hilarious that you're able to make battle toilets in Zelda. That, that for one, deserves an applause. All right, Zelda out here. She's looking at her eyebrows, and... You think it'd be better if I shaved my eyebrows? Eh? No, not really. I think they're cute as they are. Uh, okay, an actual cute comic. <laughs> but... Why would you shave your eyebrows? I will never understand women that shave off their eyebrows. Even if they're bushy or whatever, dude. It just doesn't look natural if you have no eyebrows. It's weird, and the worst part is when they shave them off and then they draw them back on. What are you, a canvas? What are you doing? Might as well just play tic-tac-toe up there at that point. We finally have a male heir for the Gerudo Thorn. Now we just have to make sure we don't name him Garendorf so he doesn't bring calamity to the world. Question. Yet, what is your question, soldier? I named him Ganondorf. <laughs> that is indeed a problem. That That is indeed a problem. Do they know about the whole legend of Ganondorf? I feel like after all the thousands of years and different iterations, do they actually keep the legend of Ganondorf alive? Or is that just something that just happened? I don't know. Maybe they do that knowingly. I don't know. They were helping him. Sir, a second Korok has hit the tower and... No... Are you just gonna ram him into just the Skyfield Tower? Is that how they all got broken? 
<laughs> okay. Oh boy, why are people like this? You give them creative tools and they will make the worst jokes imaginable. But then again, you know, I, I'm able to make my own videos and I make the worst jokes imaginable. So who am I to really say anything? So, Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom with, I'm not a DLC, I'm not a DLC. <laughs> okay, what a face. And to be fair, I agree, it's not quite a DLC. It is like an expansion, if you will. Like, it just changed the world, kind of like Cataclysm did with World of Warcraft. <laughs> changed the name of the game. Quite literally, did change the name of the game. So, Breath of the Wild jumping off a cliff and, all right. Normal, dives down a little further, and like, ear, splashes in the water. <laughs> just gets that face stuck on it. Yeah, I mean, with all that wind force is constantly pelting him, I, I don't imagine he'd be making a good face, just kind of like the opening of Konosuba when they're all falling. Like, <laughs> Probably what would happen, man. There's a lot of G's going on there. Tears of the Kingdom reuses predecessor's assets. That's no good. But Majora's Mask reuses his predecessor's assets, and there we go. Why has he got a beetle nose? <laughs> I mean, yeah, uh, Majora's Mask. Actually, I think a lot of people didn't enjoy Majora's Mask at the start. I didn't hear too much hype around it back in the day, but, like, I loved the heck out of it. I thought it was fantastic. And, yeah, I did know that they did reuse a lot of the assets because the whole thing was, like, an alternative timeline of all these different people. Still thought it was good. And again, I got to see Malin for a second time. Well, actually, I had a third. <laughs> because, because he's got both versions of her. Uh, and that was great. Oh, Seedon in here taking a snapshot of what's under his trunks and... Fish sticks. Okay. Okay. Fish sticks. I see. Why is it going, first off, to Zelda of all things? This turned into an NTR? Usually people ship seed on with Link. I'm surprised it's Zelda receiving this one here. Now, now I'm really confused of all the shipping that's going on. Funny joke though, funny joke. I see. So after the upheaval, people began using nearby materials to strengthen and bolster tarnished weapons. How resourceful. Yup. Some of these are... Uh, certainly rather creative. <laughs> the sword with the rock on it. Oh, what is this one? And the light dragon reaper out there and um... Uh... Link? <laughs> Link? I maybe have used parts of you, my dearest girlfriend. <laughs> like your toenails and your fangs and other things, your horns. I'm sure you wanted me to use that. I mean, after all, she did have a sword. His sword stuck in her head, so yeah, why not use your girlfriend as a weapon? Sure, that yeah, that's a that's a quote. So sorry out here, uh, and all the Koroks going yeah. Link not reacting. Link Maron best girl definitely. Uh, the Goku and Apona loving it. Um, the fish girl okay no not not so happy about that one there. Gerudo I don't remember her too much but yeah Gerudos are great. Oh okay, okay I see all the builders liking. Uh, Zelda uh, oh. I mean, canonically, yes. <laughs> I mean, he does typically go after Zelda. I think there's only been a few times. Uh, like, Link's Awaken, he, he went after that one dream girl. Is there another one? <laughs> oh, yeah, Twilight Princess. Midnight, I guess. I need to reach my friend, says Korok, Zelda. And Link is right there. It's on the other side, wait. So wait, is this just the other way around? Is there gonna be a Korok trying to get Zelda to Link at this point? Oh man, have the turntables turned, my friend. Oh, they would be happy to assist in this way. I would love a little bean Zelda and Link. That would be cute. Little bean Koroks, that's actually a great merch idea. Zelda dear, are you practicing the ocarina? Of course, father. Impa. Teach me how to kill a man. <laughs> I mean, ca canonically, in Ocarina of Time, that does make a lot of sense. Where else did she learn how to be like that tomboy ninja thing out there other than Impa? I mean, yeah, when she ran away with Impa that one time out there from the, you know, Ganondorf burning the castle down, that's probably where she learned it. But maybe she learned it before. So little Zelda glaring at Ganon. So what's your plan? I get super shredded and I punch him in the face. <laughs> he just looks so evil in Ocarina of Time when they're just looking through the window. And he, he's just like this clearly evil bad guy. Like, come on, man. 
But then again, he did look very goofy back in the day. Back in the day, those graphics were good, okay? Don't look back at what he's looking like back then, okay? It's not gonna be pretty. You mean, you're not a mysterious ninja femboy twink? I can't believe I was in love with a chick. <laughs> As he goes away from the crying cell. She's just crying and stuck in there. <laughs> Look how sad she is. I always thought that she was a girl. You know, like, I just thought she was a ninja girl when I first saw her. I mean, I had, like, even as a kid, I thought it was probably Zelda, but I, I still thought it was a girl. I didn't ever thought it was a dude. So Link sees his ascendability out here, and he goes up to the roof. Ugh. Hey, tapestry washing day, as the bird takes it away. Like, wait a minute. Whoosh. Uh, <laughs> it just keeps ascending forever. I mean, usually he has a wall where he can and can, but I guess if you take it away in time. Oh god, he would probably die. That'd just be like that weird dream where I just always just keep floating up and I can't go back down. And I, I hated that dream as a kid. I don't have that anymore, but as, as a kid, that's PTSD for me. Anyway, that's where I'm going to call our final Zelda meme video. Definitely for certain this time out here, okay? If you guys want to see my other final Zelda meme videos, I have them <laughs> backlog go check them out they're great i'm sure you guys are big fans but for now you know i at least hope to see you beautiful sons of guns again in the next video